TLWN 722N version 2 and version 3. Now this, this adapter is available in online shopping market. Version 1 is the awesome Wi-Fi adapter for doing wireless penetration testing because it supports monitor mode and package injection uh, without at the default driver and this chipset are also stopped coming in the market but version 2 and version 3 the chipset which has been used it it we can utilize that chipset for supporting monitor mode and package injection in this today for that we have to download specific driver in this today's video i will show you how you can download specific driver for tl wn 722n version 2 per version 3 and here you can see that unboxing video three days ago i have made and one request guys uh complete 100 subscriber uh please if you are seeing this at if you are seeing this that time that time also uh, if 99 subscriber is left then complete 100 subscriber one subscriber asking please subscribe it okay i want to and the driver which we will install today we will install in our kali linux and one more thing if you are using any kind of os uh, just like uh, ubuntu parrot uh, or any kind of linux distribution then this uh, this thing will work in that operating system also okay let's start our video first what you have to do here you can see one uh, get, GitHub repository is there. GitHub.com pen tester so home RT uh, that uh, driver. This you have to navigate to uh, to uh, redirect to uh, this link. I will give the link in description also. Once you obviously check it out and the process I will show you how you can install driver. It will be fully automated process. Yes, guys, fully automated process. Only you have to run few commands to install driver in your system. So without wasting any time, let's start our video from now. I will give the link in description also, or you can see the link in your screen also. You navigate to your uh, to this uh, link, and I have given all the manual in uh, below, and here you can see. And in this video, I will show you how you can. Before that, I want to show you something. If I do iw uh, sorry, cat hcos then in your, here you can see i am using the latest version of uh, kali linux so first uh, go to your terminal and we, uh, before git cloning here i you, you can see one uh, bash script is there if you click on here then here you can see some uh, codes are written there if you know uh, linux uh, uh, if you are familiar with linux then you can obviously uh, understood this code what is this and what is written here all absolutely uh, basic uh, what i will say bash scripting i have done here i you can check it out and if you want any uh, do changes then you can check it out that also let's uh, move to our uh, sorry okay guys here you can see this green color box code written here click on this code and here you can see when url is given click on this button it will copy to your uh, system or control c or copy it whatever you want then uh, go back to your terminal then type this command git clone then paste the url and here you can see it is cloning my this repository and make sure your internet uh, connection should be there Mm, now what we have to do uh, we have to uh, here i have given the commands also but uh, no need i am showing you first we have to navigate to this directory and then if you type ls then here you can see one bash script is there one readme.file is there one error.c file is there uh, only we need this file this is the important file in our system uh, the rest thing it will do automatically now what we have to type chmod plus x we have to give the executable permission to it if i type ls hyphen la then here you can see now it has been get executable permission for uh everyone now what we have to do type sudo uh dot slash auto dot this one and here you can see author so my name and my youtube channel name 
and uh, here all the comments are given here also you can copy and paste from here also by whatever you want and here you can see uh, doing the uh, further uh, things okay guys uh, this will automatically install uh, the driver in your system I am not I will not cut any part of the video in between because this is important and here you have to know what I have doing if you uh, I will not cut any part of the video it will automatically install our driver I will just fast forward this video uh, for saving our time and here you can see one warning has been given in the Apple statement uh, that ignore this warning uh, uh, this will automatically install don't tension uh, leave it let it be uh, it it will take few minutes of time okay guys here you can see something please reboot your system and 100% done when you will see these two things then you have to understand that our driver has successfully installed only what we have done only done this few comments uh, from my repository uh, and one more thing guys uh, you uh, follow my this uh, follow follow me in github I will give the link in description also follow me and here you can see uh, please uh, our driver has been successfully installed in our system here you can see it now uh, uh, now here it now we have to reboot our system let's reboot it I will not uh, let's cross out and restart and here you can see uh, we are restarting our system let's see let it be loaded okay guys if uh, I am doing this one in virtual box if you are uh, running this one in your main machine also the same thing will be there and here you can see it is taking time few minutes and let's log into our system okay at present in our system driver has successfully installed let's plug our Wi-Fi adapter in uh, in our system I am plugging it okay I have plugged let's go to device USB and wireless network here you can see our Wi-Fi adapter has been changed Checked here and one more thing guys uh, one general knowledge I am giving you if you if you want to take you can take it by your wish uh, if you by default your Wi-Fi adapter will not work how if you're running in virtual box what you have to do click on USB click on this plus sign select your Wi-Fi adapter uh, mainly your Wi-Fi adapter name will be R real tech 8021 this name you can see click on you have to click on this name and it will be added okay only this much you have to do to, uh, to enable Wi-Fi adapter uh, then you have to click on device then click on USB then click on your Wi-Fi adapter only this much and here you can see our Wi-Fi adapter has been connected let me to show you uh, one minute guys sorry let's type IW config and here you can see our Wi-Fi adapter name is WLAN0 and it is now at present at manage mode very good now if I type LS USB then here you can see our TP-Link adapter TP-Link WN7220 version 2 version 3 this is our Wi-Fi adapter uh, at present our uh, let's check monitor mode is working or not 
now to enable our uh, monitor mode in our Wi-Fi adapter there are two ways uh, normally normally we use one is I IF config uh, wireless we have to down then we have to up it again or better than is Aeromon ng Aeromon ng start then our interface name if you if you are confused with your interface name then IW config and check out this interface in my case WLAN 0 let me to un uh, uh, understand you what we are doing Aeromon ng is an uh, suit of ear crack ng if i tag ear crack ng i don't know i don't know why it is not coming but aeromon ng is a framework uh, is a part of a framework of ear crack ng and we are uh, telling him to start monitor mode in our this is our wireless uh, adapter name wlan0 and here you can see we can copy it out if we press enter it is telling to run as root then we have to run as root root so, uh, for that type sudo then uh, enter our password and here you can see monitor mode is enabled whoa this is cool and but it has giving us some warning because uh, some processes is running in our system we have to check it out for that run this command copy this command then sudo aeromon ng check kill here you can see we have killed our uh, check then you can see our while uh, wi-fi has been also disconnected network manager is not running it is showing that then we have to first again type this command sudo earmong ng start wlan0 monitor mode is enabled now type iw config see we can see our monitor mode has been enabled let's check it and this is the simplest way of enabling the monitor mode uh, with ear mon ng and let's check it uh, does really wi-fi uh, monitor mode has been enabled for that sudo arrow dump ng uh, sorry arrow dump ng then our interface name guys in case of your interface name change then here you can see uh, wlan0 wlan0 sudo arrow dump ng wlan0 we will enter monitor mode let's check it out monitor mode is working or not i am zooming out the terminal for a little bit and here you can see our monitor mode is working it is getting all the wi-fi adapter near our uh, near my computer here you can see this is our wi-fi adapter let let me to quite it out this is our Wi-Fi adapter here you can see uh, check it out to monitor uh, specifically on this uh, uh, to test package injection ear crack ng I think so guys please uh, give me a minute uh, let me just uh, check out the help I have forgotten the commands. Uh, I think not air crack ng, air play ng. Aeroplane ng. Oh. Air base ng. AD play ng. Hyphen hyphen help. And then here you can see one test command is there. Just copy this command. Then what we have to do sudo uh, we have to run this with sudo privilege for the sudo airplay ng then test then our Wi-Fi uh, sorry our uh, wireless adapter name here in case WLAN0 here you can see let's paste it out sudo airplay ng test WLAN0 let's test it here you can see package injection is working it has been tested it has tested some package injection in our near uh, local uh, uh, sorry near access points here you can see two access point we can find out and so by this we can understand uh, our package injection and monitor mode is working 
this Wi-Fi adapter is good for everything for wireless penetration testing and it's supposed 2.4 gigahertz and here if you click on network here you can see network manager is not running if I type IW config uh, here you can see monitor mode is still enabled to disable monitor mode what we have to do sudo sorry sudo arrow mon ng arrow sorry arrow mon ng stop wlan 0 see our uh, monitor mode has been stopped now it is in manage mode let's control plus l network n a t w o r k m a n a g e r see guys you have to type this command uh, ditto uh, n will capital m will capital and uh, if we type uh, if we press tab then tab will not work here what we have to do now restart run after running this command here you can see our uh, wi-fi device uh, sorry Wi-Fi adapter has been restarted and here you can see our wireless at uh, we can see our uh, nearest uh, access point uh, we are connected through it uh, so, okay guys but nothing more tell this video this much only if you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe my channel I hope so this video will helpful to you